Welcome back, little beans. Warning, the following ASMR is only aimed for beans who are in need for comfort and positive energy from a favorite Disney character. There won't be any NSFW versions of this ASMR. This is for all ages and is appropriate for all. However, if you feel uncomfortable from videos like this, then click off. To the ones who are staying, go right ahead and get all cozy in your blinkies, pop in your headphones, snack on some cannolis, and enjoy this ASMR. Oh my goodness! Uh, listener, can you go find Giuseppe because he's been missing again. Thank you so much. Oh, I gotta, gotta pile them up again. They just love to roam around a lot. <sighs> oh, there he is. <laughs> you just like to run off, do you? You don't want to act like your little brother, Enrico. Exactly. All right, I think we have everyone. What do you think, listener? Can you count? All right, that's a good total. Anyways, come on, let's go to the field. Hmm? Of course we have to come too. I mean, you know, double guard. Because the last time Giuseppe almost got eaten by a barracuda. So yeah, we need double duty. <laughs> Stop. Hmm? What do you mean? N no, I've never been up to the surface. I don't know what you're talking about. <sighs> okay. Please don't tell mom or dad about this. Uh, yeah, I actually been up to the surface. But it's not even that dangerous. It's actually very beautiful up there. And I actually met this uh, other sea monster who can transform into a human too. Yeah, he's supposed to come here and pick me up. So I think you're going to like him. He's really cool. He knows a lot about human stuff. Yeah, they're not really called land monsters, they're called humans. Mm-hmm. Anyways, I don't know when he's gonna come, but he did tell me he'll come when... I think when he's done with breakfast or something. I don't remember, but he's really cool. What's his name? Oh, his name is Alberto. He's... trust me, you're gonna like him. Alright, everyone. Go on and eat. While we sit here, waiting. What's up with the statue? Oh, this is Smuka. I actually made him just so mom and dad won't be suspicious. So that means I have the excuse to spend time with Alberto. Pretty cool, huh? Sure, I can make you. Just get one of those boulders and I can, you know, draw you, okay? Don't worry, I'll make you so pretty. Because you're me bella. <laughs> All right, there we go. Now we get to call this, uh, what do you want to call it? Okay, that's close enough. Well, now we just have to wait for Alberto to come. Yeah, we're gonna meet up at the surface. And don't worry, when we, you know, get out of the water, our skin can shapeshift into human skin. Yeah. I bet you look very beautiful. Strange, but beautiful. <laughs> I hope it won't take long. He told me to meet up right here. Mm hmm? Don't know when. <sighs> he is taking a while, though. What kind of stuff do we do? Well, we have been building a Vespa. It's, it's this sort of machine that you ride on. And, uh, you know, we jump in the water, enjoy some lady in a box, and, yeah, just wait and see. Hmm. I think it's already past time. Maybe he's not coming. <sighs> I guess we have to cancel today. Come on, sis. And where do you think you're going, Luca? Ah! Uh, Alberto, you scared me! <laughs> Did I make you wait? I'm really sorry. I have to deal with my dad. Anyways, ooh, hello. 
And who is this cutie here? Oh, Alberto, I want you to meet my uh, little sister, Listener. Listener Paguro. Hmm, Alberto's corfano. Piacere, Giorlano Mon Trompeta. Uh, why are you talking to her like that? It's, I think it's a human thing how they treat, uh, girls. We have to be nice and soothing. Uh, okay. Well, we're here and she'll be joining us. Well, that sounds nice. Trust me, you're gonna love the human world. Alright, let's go! Come with me, listener. It's not that far. <sighs> Come on, listener. If you need help with walking- I can help you with walking. It's actually quite easy. It's just like swimming, but no fins, tail, you technically float, but it's like the exact same thing. I'll help you. Uh, Alberto, I can help my sister. You don't have to- Come on, Luca. I just wanted to, you know, help out your sister and maybe get along with her because she's kind of cute. Uh, Alberto, are you- What? Are you trying to hit on my sister? What? Why would I ever hit her? I mean, th that just seems kind of mean. Why would I ever hit her? She's- I mean, you like her. I don't know what you're talking about, Luca. I mean, that's your sister. I mean, yeah, I like her. She just seems, uh... Let's just go out. Alright. I'll hold on to you, sis. Sis, don't freak out! Don't freak out! Yes, Alberto, yes, we can shapeshift. Yeah, he does look kind of weird. Are you kidding me? I look amazing. You sure do, Alberto. Now, this is the only quick way. You gotta shake off the water. See what I'm doing? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow. You do look kind of weird, but we almost look alike. <laughs> you look very beautiful, sis. And hot. Huh? N nothing. Um, so, uh, yeah, just... Bring your foot forward and repeat it with the other leg, and that's pretty much walking. I invented it. Thank you very much. He's a really smart guy. He knows what he's doing. Just do what I do, okay? Mm-hmm. Hey, you're getting it. Oh, <laughs> careful, mi bella. <laughs> Gotta try again, but this time I can be right behind you to hold you. You know, I can do that, Alberto. I'm her brother. It's okay, I'm just being a nice teacher for your sister. Uh, okay. Alright, let me push your leg a little... Yeah, like, like that. Just hold on there. And then go forward like this. I'm gonna push you a little bit. Oh, don't worry, I got you. Teacher Alberto is right behind you. You know what? I think Signor Alberto sounds a lot better. Yeah, just call me Signor Alberto. Alright, and then you push the other leg like this. Yeah, I'm kicking it with my feet. I can't do it with my hands, because I'm holding on to you. Yeah, alright. Now I'm gonna let you go. Don't flip out, okay? I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it on your own, okay? I'm letting go. My hands are over here. Hey, you're getting it. Good job, listener. Hey, Luca, look at your sister. <gasps> She's walking, just like us. Way to go, sis. <laughs> it's no problem. Of course, I did invent the walking, so... <laughs> Anyways, what should we all do today? I mean, I don't want to build a Vespa today. Maybe just do it for tomorrow because I want to spend some quality time with your sister. Oh, okay. I guess we can just sit around and maybe play in the water. Or maybe collect some more human stuff. Oh, maybe you can show her some human stuff. What do you say? I can show you some stuff. Yeah, I am a collectible sort of guy. And yeah, had to help with my dad. Pretty cool, he's not even here. So we can barge in the party. 
What do you say, mi bella? All right, let's head over to the tower. It's not that far. Just follow me. These human stuff look amazing, listener. He has so many items, like, I can't even count. It's so amazing that humans build all of this. All right, here we are. Seriously, how come your dad never comes? Uh, he's a really busy guy. Yeah, always leaves the place to me because, you know, I'm a big boy. Coming a man. Anyways, come on. Watch your step, listener. Don't worry, I'm right behind you. Welcome to my home. Yeah, it's a, it's a little cluttered, but I am cleaning up a little bit. Plus, Luca and I were making a Vespas out of these things, so it's okay. Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> yeah. Hey, show her the lady in the box. Oh yeah, I really like this. Luca actually fixed it, so it's pretty cool. So how do you do it again, Luca? Oh, you turn this and place it on the spinny thingy. Alright. Oh, there we go. It's playing. Cool, huh? Not as cool as you. <laughs> Your face is turning red, listener. Are you alright? Maybe it's because I'm so closer to you. <laughs> Pretty cute. Oh, sis, come here. <sighs> this is what me and Alberto were building. See? Yeah, we're building a Vespa because that leads to freedom. When we build one, we'll be out of here and maybe travel in the human world. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah, we were just trying to build it and it was a little rough. But we're gonna do it again tomorrow because, you know, Alberto doesn't want to build one today. Maybe you should come with us, listener. We can ride the Vespa together. Of course you can come. It's an open party. Plus, I wouldn't mind having a cutie coming with me. Yes, yeah, sis. We can all go together. Explore. Have... Just be free for once. Up to the surface. Where? Well, there's one over there. You can see it over there. Mm-hmm. That's where we're going. How are we going to carry the Vespa over there? Well, there's plenty of Vespas over there. My dad told me once. And there's plenty, so... We just swim over there, find a Vespa, and boom. Hmm, good idea. What do you say, listener? Ride the Vespa together? <laughs> so, how should we plan all this? Hmm, maybe do it tomorrow. But what about our family? R remember you told me that they're going to take you to the depths of the ocean? Heck no, I'm not going to let that happen. We're going tomorrow morning. Oh, already? Okay. I hope the statues stay there for a while, so... I guess that's the plan for tomorrow. Are you ready for tomorrow, listener? Okay, we leave tomorrow morning. Sweet. So, uh, what should we do now? Hmm, maybe just listen to the lady in the box. Maybe, uh, swim around the place. Alright, we can do that. Baliamo, signora. <laughs> hey, I want to join too! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah.